You may be wondering why any of this matters. Uh, what's the big deal with breathing in a little dust or dirt now and then? Well, the effects of poor indoor air quality may be long-term and severe. The first symptoms are usually mild and can be mistaken for the common cold or allergies. One clue that it's related to IAQ is that the symptoms will diminish or go away altogether when the person leaves the building. Untreated though, these symptoms can increase and include headaches, dizziness, rashes, muscle pain and weakness. In addition, building moisture has also been linked to severe health issues related to bacteria, fungi and mold growth. Long-term diseases related to poor IAQ include asthma, hypersensitivity, pneumonitis, heart disease and cancer. The effects can be fatal. The duration of exposure, type of pollutant and concentration of exposure are all factors in the severity of the effects. In other words, the importance of indoor air quality is nothing to sneeze at.